Well, it's not just the races impacted by the weather this weekend. There are a lot of other outdoor events and concerts that have been forced to cancel or postpone, all because of the rain. Our Rich and I continues our coverage now from the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Thousands of fans were planning to fill this turn four infield at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway for the FGL Fest, featuring a concert from Florida Georgia Line. But by mid morning, that was canceled. The crew from Concessions by Cox tore down and packed up without selling a single snack. We do this once a week all up and down the coast. Um, so it's just another day for us. Uh, besides the fact that it, uh, we were here till 1 o'clock this morning setting this one up, uh, that's the way it goes. A rain out on this empty stage. But ticket buyers get a refund. Well, it's kind of a bummer, but I didn't. We were getting ready to have to go buy rain gear, so now we're not going to really have to get go. our money back. We're going to get our money back, and we're going to go to downtown and watch college football afternoon. Downtown football was just one challenge today at the Indy Ultimate. Three, two, one, pedal! Runners in the urban adventure race did not seem to mind getting wet. Heading to the next venue for the next challenge. I love running in the rain, so I, I love it. It's fun. Not that bad a nuisance or a problem? No, it's, it adds to the excitement. It's an adventure. It hasn't been that bad. It's actually kind of cold and feels good. I'd, I'd rather run in this than 95 degrees and humidity. The persistent rain could not stop the Penrod Arts Fair. These boots are made for shopping. Because it's just such a great show, and I guess we were thinking, too, there might not be so many people here today. We might get some good deals. <laughs> 350 artists making the best of a soggy situation. We've settled in now. We've got our rain gear on. I love wearing my boots. Everybody that's here looks like they're, they have boots and umbrellas, and I think it could just be a lot of fun. Rain won't stop. But the fun doesn't have to either. I'm Rich Knight, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Oh, she was enjoying it, wasn't she? All right, as for the concert, Florida Georgia Line did tweet about canceling today's FGL Fest, saying, quote, We're so bummed that this happened today to FGL Fest. Unfortunately, the weather wouldn't permit us to play, and we'd never want to put the fans in any danger. Love y'all. We'll be back. Now, if you were planning to go, you can get your money back. You can find out how by checking out this story on WTHR.com.